Hi, Fire Signs, Leo, Aries, and Sagittarius. Welcome to my channel. My name is Chelsea. In this reading, we're going to find out who is missing you like crazy and why. To book a personal reading with me, all information is in the description box below. And today is the 26th of May, 2023. Time here in Bali, Indonesia is 12.31 p.m. Please bear in mind that this is a collective reading for Leo, Aries, and Sagittarius. If you were divinely guided to watch this video, this message is meant for you, even if you're dealing with the same sign. Okay, now let's get your reading started. Spirits and angels, please show me for Leo, Aries, and Sagittarius. Who is missing them like crazy and why? Please bear in mind that roles can be reversed between you and this person. Two of swords at the bottom of the deck. There isn't much communication between you and this person right now, okay? Or two of swords can indicate indecision, someone just Mm, standing at a crossroad can't make a decision right now in regards to you or you regards in regards to them or that you, this could be someone that you're unsure about okay um or if it's not that two sorts block communication again looks like you're not really speaking to this person right now this person could be like you are leo aries sagittarius strong aries energy here could be a pisces cancer or a scorpio could be a capricorn could be a taurus libra gemini aquarius can be any sign Hmm. This person loves you or cares about you, Nine of Cups. I guess they miss communicating with you since the Two of Swords is right here. Since both of you are not really communicating with each other right now. Three of Wands. Maybe this person lives far away from you or um, can indicate distance. Or maybe both of you, if it's not distance, both of you could, could be distancing each other of distancing from each other and we've got the aries energy here with the emperor five of pentacles and love first hmm. they could be missing you being the emperor someone who is sure someone who is in charge but the emperor could also indicate like a father figure some of you like a father figure or an uncle someone older than your grandfather could be missing you that's just for some of you okay but most likely this is someone you're not speaking with the devil in reverse can indicate you may have disconnected from this person due to unhealthiness is that even a word is that even a word or toxicity got the high fund right here this is someone either wants to commit to you or at one point in time both of you may have been committed to each other if it's not that this higher fund is a student teacher's dynamic some of you could be a teacher miss missing you or it could be a student missing you okay or someone who used to teach you a lot or you used to teach them a lot it could be literally like it could be the teacher or the student, but or it could just be life lessons in general, okay? Somebody who teaches, somebody who who guides. Maybe this person misses you guiding them, okay? Because again, the Hierophant indicates like someone giving guidance and teachers usually do that. So this person could be missing you, giving them guidance. Like setting them straight. Or again, it could go vice versa. Five Pentacles here is in love first. Page of Swords. It's like a return energy. This person could be wanting you to return to how things used to be, or how, wanting things to return to how they used to be. Okay. Look at the Queen of Swords in love first. Very little communication. It feels or no communication. This could be someone that you. Either you resent or they could be resenting you. There's something going on here that I feel something with communication most likely because a lot of swords here. 
yeah, you look, you're not talking to this person right now, this moment, and vice versa. Or someone doesn't want to talk to the other person while the other person wants to, okay? Let's see more. There's something that they miss about this, again, stability. Queen of Pentacles, this person could be a Virgo, Capricorn, missing feeling stable, feeling secure. Maybe you've given this person a sense of security, a sense of dependability. You can, you know, have fun again. It's like teacher-student dynamic. So um, maybe there was some sort of structure, habit, routine that this person could be missing. And you may have provided this person a certain structure or routine that they used to. But right now, maybe the routine has changed. Yeah. The sun here is in what first. They're very unhappy. This is not an energy where they feel happy being apart from you or feeling happy that both of you are not speaking with each other right now. I don't see this person likes that both of you are not connecting actively how like how it used to let's see more some of you could be a mother figure queen of pentacles just for some of you the hangman is right here there's a pause between you and this person they often daydream about you wonder about you and then eight of cups here is a verse this person may be thinking about i think they are stuck they're stuck because, again, maybe you have... There's something that has been done over and over again every single day between you and this person that they actually miss. So they keep returning to Eight of Cups. In other words, they keep returning to how things used to be, how it was just so stable, how they felt protected, guided again. Those sense, that sense of, again, security. They could be missing you like crazy right now. Most likely it's due to non-communication. They miss that communication, that daily communication. And we've got the Queen of Wands, Queen of Cups, and what first this person could be a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, Leo, Aries, Sagittarius, can be any sign. This person is sad. Mm -hmm. These two queens are actually looking at each other. No, the queen of wands is looking at the queen of pentacles, while the queen of pentacles is looking at the pentacles here. Maybe they miss, like, there's something about someone, it could be you or this person, working on something that they're prioritizing right now. So someone may be feeling kind of ignored. And the Queen of Cups in my verse, feeling sad. Maybe this is someone emotionally unavailable, or you may be emotionally unavailable for this person right now. It's like, I don't want to talk, I don't want to deal with it. Someone has like a more important business to focus on. There's something about priority pr priorities right now that either you or this person could be. And it's like, Something else I need to do, something else I need to focus, and I can't really divide, right, two swords, like a division. I can't divide my time right now. Hmm. Could be you or this person, but definitely missing how things used to be. Just, you know, like a structure, of course, with how if I'm missing when things were healthy or healthier, okay? The temperance and what first, we've got the cherry. This may be someone you... Uh, again, at a distance from you, or you may have met this person um, abroad. For some of you, not all of you, they miss going on a trip with you or traveling with you. Hmm. This person could be quite emotionally unstable right now. Again, temperance in reverse. But there is a pause. Something is not moving forward between two of you. They could be feeling like they're like, again, there's this energy. I want things to be how it used to be. I miss things how it used to be. When we were happy, when everything seems positive, when, you know, the Queen of Pentacles in the Hierophant, 
when I felt safe, when I felt like I could rely on you, that you could be my rock and vice versa. But it's not happening right now. It's, things have changed, right? Page of Wands and one first. Maybe you're ignoring them. Maybe you're not. Again, Page of Messenger is in one first. I see a lot of communication issues between the two of you right now, okay? Or lack of communication, all right? Take care, Leo Aries, Sag. This is your reading. I hope you resonated in some way, shape, or form. If you did, please hit like, share, and subscribe. I'm open for personal readings. If you'd like to book me, my information is in the description box below. I do give free personal readings, but only during my live stream, which I think I'm going to do it soon. Um, but whoever sends me super chat, I will bump up the questions. Uh, but I'll still do the best that I can to answer everyone's questions. And also, I'll be doing individual sign readings during the live stream, okay? But don't forget to hit on the bell notification button because it's up to my mood, how I feel <laughs> when I want to do it. And usually, it's very last minute. But anyway, take care. I hope to see you back here again sooner than later. Bye.